In this video, we're just going to take a really fast look on how to do testing on a Canon SX engine printer like this HP LaserJet 2. A lot of this applies to the Apple LaserWriter 2 and a lot of printers. Um, God, there were like 300 printers that use this Canon engine. And so let's take a look. So if you're working on an Apple, the covers look quite a bit different, but when you get inside, the only real difference is the covers and the formatter board. So with any SX engine printer, you can do an engine test just to make sure the print mechanism is working by pressing a button that's hidden under a cover. The buttons on the DC controller board, which is part of the SX engine, the formatter board is made by the manufacturer, but the DC controller comes with the printer engine. So you can see right here on the HP, there's a hole in this cover. I believe on the Apple, there's no hole. So there's a cover there you have to remove. It's on the right side of the printer. So take a non-conductive probe of some kind. I'm just using this CRT tool. And once you take the cover off, you just poke it in the hole and there's a button behind there. So this is a print pattern created by the DC controller. There are no characters or anything. It's just a striped page. It's just turning the laser off and on in a pattern. Um, but it lets you tell the entire print mechanism and see if it's working. So that tells us the print mechanism's working. So while I'm at it, I'll also show how to do a test on an HP LaserJet 2. Fix this camera angle real quick. <clears throat> so on the HP LaserJet 2, you can also print a test page. Just press the online button to take it offline. Press and hold the button where it says test. As soon as it says 05 self test, let go. Give it a minute and it will test all the RAM and then it'll print out a test page. If you hold it down longer, it'll go to 04 self test and that will run continuously. It'll just keep printing the same page over and over until it runs out of paper. So that's great if you're testing, uh, you know, intermittent misfeed issues, but normally that's just a waste. Um, you can also do a font page, print fonts. Um, and that's the same button, just tap it once, don't have to hold it. And there we go. And there's a standard test page. I believe the 04 page doesn't print this at the top every time. I think it just prints all of this. And for thoroughness, here's a font page. And I'm just doing this because I see this question come up now and then. I've answered a few questions on Reddit, people asking about this, and it just came up again. And I figured the easiest way to answer is just to do a really quick video. And I love old printers, so any chance to play with my old, uh, my good old laser jet, I'll take. So I hope this was helpful and informative for you. If you want to see more about this old 8 laser jet, the very first videos I did were restoring this machine, and I apologize for the audio quality. I've learned a lot since then. But uh, thank you for coming, and I'll see you next time.